Hi, Dr. Larry here with the Tillman Solar Wind House. And from previous YouTubes, you probably remember seeing the wind turbine, which is up there at the top of the tower turning, and the electric car and all the things that go on around here. But today I want to talk to you about another part of the sustainability here, and that's that it's raining today, and all of the water that's falling on the front part of the house comes down to the rain gutter just below the two solar thermal Follow the eave all the way over here to the end see where it comes down and we're catching the rainwater here in a thousand liter uh, catch tank that I believe was used at one time for uh, uh, golf cart or golf um, course um, chemical spraying or something anyway it's been washed out thoroughly and the water as you can see we have about I think there's an indicator over here somewhere around the vicinity of uh, 900 liters of water at this point and that's uh, the catch system now let me the first tank here has a, a submersible pump and that goes over here to where the washing machine is and you can actually wash the clothes with rainwater and it makes your clothes very very this soft. This is the main reason I'm catching rainwater. This is the greenhouse. Part of my sustainability. Last year, this is the second year for the greenhouse, I was able to grow a number of vegetables in the greenhouse including tomatoes, beets, carrots, and a variety of other things. Um, this is uh, mid-March and getting on towards the end of March actually and we're going to take a look inside and see what's going on in it. Alright, we're inside the greenhouse and right here you can see something growing and what that is is black Simpson lettuce. There are four rows of black Simpson lettuce uh, growing on this upper uh, level. Now there are 12 hanging pots in this little 10 by 10 greenhouse and these are full of tomato starts right now and they haven't, they haven't started coming up just yet. Down here at the bottom, uh, which this goes all the way into the ground beneath the greenhouse, uh, there are carrots and over here we have radish. Now already up because it was planted earlier, as you can see, there are white onions planted here. And follow that on down here, we have yellow onions, or the sweet onions, and I like them real well. And there are more starter pots here for a variety of things. These two pots outside the door will have tomato trees. And if you know anything about those, I sent away for them, and they are started. They're up. I'm growing. I'm starting them out in the house where it's warm. Out here beside the greenhouse is an area I've got filled with some very rich, deep topsoil, and that's going to be for a variety of vegetables as well. Part of the sustainability, and it's all part of being independent and kind of living the life that you want to live, being independent, not depending on others all the time. Here's a look at the wind turbine today and it seems to be uh, moving right along. So we're getting some charge out of that. Back side of the house. Also going to put a few pepper plants right in here and I filled that with that uh, topsoil as well. So there'll be some pepper plants planted here this year.